As COVID vaccine requirements grow across the nation, so do the number of fake vaccination cards. It's a big problem, especially as summer ends and thousands head back to college. News Asian correspondent Marky Martin has the story for us from Texas. Move over, fake IDs. The new college concern is fake COVID-19 cards. 664 colleges now require the vaccine for admission. The black market and social media now ripe with counterfeits. This Instagram account called Vaccine Cards is selling them for $25 a piece. Conservative radio host Monica Matthews, who has more than 70,000 followers on Twitter, tweeted this. My daughter bought two fake IDs online for $50 while in college, shipped from China. The cards going for almost $500 on websites like Jimmy Black Market, Counterfeit Center, and Buy Express Documents. The FBI now warning people, if they buy these fakes, they could also end up a victim. If you fall for one of these and buy a card thinking, okay, well, I'm not going to get the shot and I'm going to get this card, they now have your financial information. Alex Del Carmen teaches criminology at Tarleton State University. He says the number of people making and selling fake vaccine cards is something investigators will have to play catch up on. This is probably one of the most significant issues that law enforcement is going to have to deal with in the coming weeks and months. The problem with this is the magnitude of it, meaning that, that there are so many of these that are around the industry right now that law enforcement is going to be handicapped as to what they can and cannot do. Nationwide, police have begun cracking down. Cases like this one in California, where a bar owner was arrested after undercover agents accused him of serving fake COVID cards instead of beers. He was in possession of a number of other unfilled out COVID-19 vaccination cards, a laminating machine, laminate, several other cards that were finished that it appears that they were waiting to be given to people. In Dallas, Marky Martin, News Nation.